I'm John. Uh, baby Charlie is just down there, you'll probably see him in a moment. Uh, we wanted to do another band tour video, you might have seen our brothers. Um, it's a bit of an improvement on the other designs. Um, the last couple of vans, so John did the first van for himself. We then set up a van conversion business. We then did a couple of higher vans and this is a bespoke model. So this is, the customer has basically chosen everything. They wanted a Sandy, they wanted that signature model, but they just wanted a few improvements. So we're gonna show you now those improvements and amendments and hopefully you might like them. I'm Nate Murphy and I have literally just bought this van to show you how to build a van. We have made a really detailed course which will help you go from this to this. You will learn everything you need. We help you specify your electrical system and you'll be able to access a community all building their own vans at the same time. So this kitchen is based on our um, original Sandy, uh, but like I said, there are some improvements. So the first one, which I love, is this worktop space. You can take it off. You've got the mini bell fast sink underneath, which is one of the features that we always put in. It gives it that real cottagey feel, and then you simply pop it back on, and you've got extra worktop space, which is great. Uh, we have got the drawers down here. We've got four drawers, loads of storage. An extra thing we've put in this one, which we haven't done before, is the oven. As you can see there, loads of room, works really nicely. We've got the two ring burner hob. We've got the fold out table just here, which is really, really sturdy. And over here, we've got a drinks cabinet, which you just pull out and then you can keep everything on there, which works well. We've also got one of the control panels just here. We have got the 230 socket. We've got the light switches. As you can see, loads of spotlights, warm LED, which is ones we always like to use. Uh, we've got the USB, we've got the maxi fan controller just here. I'm going to press go, and as you can see, it's working just there. So we've got the bathroom just here, we've got the light switches, and then we've also got a fan. But we put them on separate switches this time, which works well. Uh, we've obviously got the Thetford flushing toilet, which we always use, and then we've got the shower just here. It's thermostatic, so you've got hot and cold water. Everything is completely bespoke made at the workshop, which just means that obviously it's completely watertight and works really well. So we have some more storage here, which is really useful for your bottles. So for the floor, we use solid engineered oak flooring. So it's scratch resistant, uh, very hard wearing, and then around the edges, we trim with solid oak as well, just to keep that premium feel. So we have a Dometic fridge, which is 65 litres, bottle of Prosecco in there, chilling. Uh, really handy off grid, uses minimal power. So what we've done on the removal steps is we've added French cleats. So it's nice and sturdy now. So you can just pull, pull yourself up on the bed like so. So this is our hatch door. So if you ever need to escape into the front or vice versa, that's how we do that. And above we have some storage. So extra storage for the van. Uh, USB reading light, which is really handy. It's got a built-in socket as well. We have our Roman blinds, which are blackout. So that keeps you nice and private in the night time. We've got solid oak here, here, here. So all this is trimmed with real wood to give that premium finish. Uh, this is the media center. So we've got a 22 inch smart TV. We've got the Truma Combi Boiler controller, the Victron control, DAB radio, and some more places to charge. So obviously it's really important to have a lot of storage. So we have these huge drawers. So we have one, two, three, four. This is our electrical system. So it's all Victron. We have a 300 amp hour uh, lithium battery, the 230 electrics, uh, Victron Multi Plus, a Victron Lynx, Victron MPPT for the solar. So this van has 400 watts of solar on the roof and an Orion uh, battery to battery alternator charger. So this customer asked for a outdoor shower. So when they come back to the beach or they've been on a muddy walk, they can wash their feet off or their dog. A 12 volt socket at the back. So if they need to inflate the paddle boards, 
and we have the rubber matted floor as well to keep it nice and watertight. We've also got two bespoke fly screens fitted on this van so this stops the mosquitoes out in the summertime uh, and you can have all the doors open to keep your van nice and cool. So on this van we've got a Bayama F80 awning fitted so it's 3.4 meter. Uh, as you can see Charlie's enjoying the shade a must if you're traveling around off-grid. So we also have a roof rack and ladder fitted on this so this houses the solar and there's a nice deck on top which we'll show you in a bit. Um, so a great addition to the van. So thank you for watching our video I hope you enjoyed it please leave comments below. And if you want a van please get in touch with Orbit Van Conversions and if you want to hire a van uh, for the weekend or for long periods of time please get in touch as well and um, we've got lots of vans in the workshop and we'd love to hear from you. Bye. You may have noticed that you can buy our ebook. Our ebook shows you how to build a van conversion. It has 190 pages of text, diagram, and images showing you various options or various systems. It also comes with 25 videos that show you hands on how to do many parts of building a van. Also, coming out soon, we have a course. The course releases in December, and if you sign up now, you get early access and a discount. The course is really in depth. It shows you everything from how to use basic tools all the way through to doing your gas, your water and your electric installation. Not only that, but within the course, we support you hands on in making your electrical specification. And you get to join a community of like-minded van builders who are building their vans at exactly the same time. Follow the links to find out more and thanks for watching.